Okay, presentation number six is entitled The Third Party Invitation. And the third party invitation relates to prospecting and network marketing. So if I know Carol, I don't go up and ask Carol if she is interested in earning extra income or if she is interested in a product. Reason being, even if she was interested, she would probably want me to think that she was doing fine and she would reply, no, I'm not interested, or she probably wouldn't want you to sell to her, so she would say, no, I'm not really interested. So what I can say is something like, Carol, I'm launching a new business venture and I thought you might be able to help me. Do you know anyone that would be interested in earning some extra income? That's a third party invitation. Notice the third party is anyone. When you ask, do you know anyone, you leave the door open for Carol, but also for Carol to tell you about someone else. For example, I might ask Carol and she might not be interested, but she might know someone who is recent, who's recently mentioned to her that she was looking for something like this. So if I would have asked Carol directly, I would have never learned about her friend that would be interested. So if Carol were to say, sure, I am interested, remember you're saying, Carol, do you know anyone that's interested? That leaves the door open for Carol to say, sure, I'm interested, what is it? Don't go into your company or any type of long explanation. Ask if they know what residual income is. Do you know what residual income is? If yes, ask them what they know. And it doesn't matter what they say, just direct them to the introduction and these first four presentations in this set. If they don't know what residual income is, direct them to the introduction and the first four presentations. It's, it's very simple. It's as simple as that. After reviewing the residual income in network marketing via the introduction and the first four presentations, then use your company tools, your DVDs, your websites, on your business itself to expose them to what your company is. So overcoming rejection. Using the third party invitation, it's impossible to be rejected because you're just asking if they know anyone. If they reply, I'm not interested, you might take that as a rejection, but that wasn't your question. Your question was if they know anyone, not if they were interested. So if they say they don't know anyone, give them your card and ask them to please let you know if they do think of anyone in the future or run across anyone in the future that might be interested. And you're fine. And in all cases, the third party invitation, the do you know anyone, keeps you from the possibility of being rejected. So the next presentation deals with time management uh, in network marketing. And presentation number seven is entitled, Where You Spend Your Time. So I will see you at presentation number seven. <music>